If you do go on to enjoy today's video, please remember to hit that like button. Of course, subscribe for more FIFA 21 and eventually FIFA 22 content. If you want to get some coins to see you through Path to Glory, head on over to u7bystore.com. New link down below. Brand new website, but same old code. TVM gets you 5% off at checkout. What is going on guys, Tim here, welcome back to another day of 6pm content. Here we go then. <laughs> Are we going to get uh, player after player after player every day? That's kind of what we're, uh, well, what I'm expecting anyway. And of course, tomorrow we should get some sort of upgrades back again. I'm kind of hoping that they keep that structure. Not because it's easy to predict or anything, it's just I like upgrades. I mean, I'm kind of hoping that we get them today, but you never know. So, in terms of the objective... I mean, I wasn't really expecting anything for today. We'd still have the uh, the Goosens, of course, so you can go get that done. Silver Summer is there. Uh, Messlier is still there, of course, if you're interested. Silver Beasts, the Weekend League uh, boosts, if you are still playing Weekend League. You crazy people, uh, you can get extra picks and so on and so forth. But the thing we're all here for... Actually, I'll tell you what I'm going to do first. Uh, I'm going to... If it wants to load... Hmm... I mean, it is five past. Maybe I've missed it. I'm not sure. They had a 100k pack there yesterday. Uh, not at six, because again, I missed it. But they had one later on in the evening. Ooh. Joshua Kimmich. 97 rated right mid. Which is interesting. Um, I'm trying to think. What other cards has Joshua Kimmich got? And what position are they? <laughs> Do you know what? I don't think he has a right-back card, right? Even though he started life as a right-back, and he transitioned a lot quicker than Philip Lahm did. But the interesting thing about that for me is they could have made that a right-back. Would it have been as desirable? Maybe not. That card, though, 4-star, four 4-star, four and honestly, you can play him anywhere. One of those cards. But not only can you play him anywhere and he'll do a decent job, he will do a job as if he was built for that position. 99 acceleration... With 99 shot power, 99 long shots, 99 positioning. You play him as a winger, I mean, you, you'd be very hard-pressed to find someone who's going to be better. If you play him as a midfielder, 99 short passing, 98 long passing, 96 vision, 99 crossing, you're going to find it hard to, to get anyone better. If you play him as a CDM, 95 stand tackle, 93 defensive awareness, 93 interceptions, and 90 slide tackle, you'll find it hard to, to pick up anyone who's going to be better. He is literally a monster in every position i would love to see that guy's points per position on footbin because i bet you the bare minimum it will be is probably going to be a striker and it'll be 94 95 i will look but that is going to be phenomenal now in terms of uh how how expensive i wouldn't be surprised to see this be well over half a million four segments 83 84 86 87 I don't even think I don't know how much it I don't know how much that is. I've got absolutely no idea how much that is, but that's not expensive. I don't care. It's one of the best cards I've ever seen, I think. Uh that is phenomenal. I, I am struggling to think of a card that's better than that. Like, you know, cards for each position. So for example, if you wanted a striker, would you get this or would you go and get Ronaldo? Yeah, maybe you would go and get... Okay, so that's just saying money is no option. You've got a chance of picking someone untradeable, right? But you need a striker. Are you going to take an, uh, an untradeable Richarlison or are you going to take an untradeable Kimmich? You want a striker. You'll probably take Richarlison mainly for five-star skills. I'm pretty sure he has them. But also because he's an actual striker and it would maybe feel a bit weird playing Kimmich as a striker. But if you were looking for a player that you could play anywhere and be more than competitive in every position... This is outrageous. I, I don't, I'm not one of these people who's going to stand up and scream and throw my chair at the wall at how good the card is, but mark my words, this is one of the best cards I've ever seen in a FIFA. He is absolutely astonishing. Four star, four star, and stats everywhere. I, I'd love, his total in games must be in, I mean, wow. I'll have a look at all that in a minute, but, um,. While I have a little break from creaming over him, uh, I want to just have a little look to see if there's anything else. There's nothing else that they've they've dropped today that I can see anyway. Those are still there. Uh, you can do those now, and, and pretty much. I mean, maybe you wouldn't. Maybe it's not cost effective to do those, and and then go and complete Joshua Kimmich. But if you do need a high-rated card, maybe. Um, 
I, d I don't remember seeing it, so I'm going to go back and have a look. Did they require... Now, they've done it again. It's really interesting, and I don't quite understand it. They must be saving it for the maybe doing more 83 times 10 or, or maybe a guaranteed summer star but they're not asking for informs or team of the seasons and yet they've put repeatable team of the season and team of the week sbcs in the store for a month i'm not really sure why they've done that if no sbc they release actually requires them can someone ask me answer me that i know the 83 times 10 82 times 8 and the 87 i think the 87 plus required a team of the week or a team of the season but that was just three and they've gone. They've they've been and gone. They expired. What did they expire? Friday. So why do we have these? There must be something else coming, or EA have forgotten that they've put these out there. I I'm I I don't know. I'm confused. Any new icons? No, of course not, because that would be too generous. Let me go and open these packs a second. Uh, not that we have anything astonishing. I will open. Okay, gotta wait for that. I will open the 25k and the 45k. I'll have to come back at 7 and see if they've dropped anything else. But uh, I think they'll probably end up dropping 100k packs or something at some point this evening. So I'll definitely open or preview, I should say, one of those. But um, I cannot wait to have a little look at Kimmich points per position and the in-game stats. Because that card looks to be one of the best I've ever seen. So unfortunately, nothing in those packs. Literally no point opening it. Uh, let me refresh, ref, refresh, refresh footbin, take you over there and have a little look at Joshua Kimmich's card because that what we're all here for. So his, um, he's a 92 rated centre back, which actually does surprise me quite considerably. So 93 rated striker, that doesn't surprise me, but a 92 rated centre back, if I gave him a shadow, turns into a 96 rated centre back. Is it possible to fit him up for a 99 rated card? That's the question. I'm going to I'm going to do it all. I'm going to go through everything. So 98 rated winger, 98 rated center mid, uh, 96 rated, 98 rated again. I mean, finisher across the board. If you want to play him in attacking positions, quite good. Same with a dead eye. I don't know if I, I mean, I'm guessing that there has been a card that goes to 99 in more than one position in the history of FIFA, but I can't think of it off the top of my head. It doesn't look like we're going to be able to get this Joshua Kimmich card to a 99 points per position, but it's not to say that this isn't one of the best cards I've ever seen. Guardian does an awful lot for him. doesn't improve the sprint speed, but to be fair, I'm not that bothered by it. 98 fullback, CDM, and central midfield player, and then 97 rated winger with a Guardian. Absolutely crazy. Uh, similar situation with the Gladiator. Backbone doesn't do an awful lot. Anchor, 97 rated centre back. Hunter turns him into a 96 rated striker and a 98 rated cam. Uh, Catalyst surprisingly doesn't do an awful lot for him. And then a shadow. So what a card that is. But uh, total in game stats. Let's compare him so we can have a little look. 2,695 total in game stats. That is crazy what other versions of Kimmich are there there's a 96 rated CDM version which has 60 less in-game stats so there's that now the the price or I mean his skill moves have gone up to a four star as well but the price of this Joshua Kimmich is going to be interesting is he going to be that much more expensive than the team of the year I don't know uh, to be quite frank I've no idea how much that team is going to or how, how much those four teams are going to cost I don't, like I said, I don't care how much that it costs because I think the card is going to be worth it regardless because he looks to be one of the best I've ever seen. I'm trying to think of another card that I love. Kante has a 91 rated something or other. And he has 300 pl plus minus, if you will, uh, less in-game stats. That's crazy. That card is, I mean, wow. I want to go look at Hullet. A card... That people will pay what 15 million for or something stupid we'll see his price no maybe not 8 million and he has less in-game stats than this joshua kimmich so okay he's got five star weak foot but who cares if this card comes in at less than 8 million <laughs> he's worth it what a player i mean right mid aside you'll have to put him in there and then probably switch positions i mean you could play him as a right mid if you really want to but i feel like that may be a bit of a waste that is unreal 
let me know in the comments if you're going to complete it. I may very well do, because having that on my account uh, sounds like something I want to do. But that's probably the player that I, I can think of off the top of my head to compare him to the most. They're probably... There's probably one or two out there that I, I should be comparing him to, but I can't think. Hullet is one of those cards that I think everyone will strive for uh, in FIFA. But you can have that Kimmich now for what is, in my opinion anyway, a reasonable SBC. Let me know if you're going to do it in the comments. If you have enjoyed this video, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel for new, and until the next time, goodbye.